western part of Gaza Strip. The whole population of Gaza is experiencing severe levels of food insecurity or even worse, according to the latest food security report released Monday 18th, March 2024. Based on the most recent analysis by the Integrated Food Security Phase Classification, ICP, or IPC, it's been revealed that if the hostilities continue, there is a high chance of fame occurring in the northern uh, governorates of Gaza and northern Gaza any time between now and May 2024. Our reporter, Kariji Tijalo, has the details. The ongoing conflict in Gaza has intensified hostilities, resulting in extensive damage to the agricultural sector. Famine is crucial for the lives and well-being of families in Gaza. The southern governorates of Tiara al balakan Khan Yunis and Rafa are now classified as emergency IPC Phase 4, with an increasing number of households facing catastrophic food insecurity. If the situation worsens, there's a risk of famine in these governorates until July 2024. Wayne Paulson, the director of the Office of Emergency and Resilience of FAO, highlighted that the latest findings are extremely concerning. He said it seems like there's a real danger of famine in the northern part of Gaza from now until May 2024. The latest findings paint an extremely concerning situation. Uh, and when we think about the north of Gaza, where the situation is the most uh, precarious, the latest analysis tells us that famine is imminent in the period between now and May in the north of Gaza. That means when we look at the trajectory of food security and nutrition statistics, we're facing a catastrophic uh, situation in technical terms. In the south of Gaza, the situation has also worsened, and there we maintain the projection of famine likely the FAO official also said the ongoing conflict has resulted in extensive harm to the farming industry, which is crucial for families in the war in Gaza Strip. So indeed, this damage has been uh, quite uh, significant. We estimate, just to use some examples, when it comes to livestock losses, obviously this is a sector that we're very concerned about. It's indispensable for the livelihoods and the survival of families in Gaza. We estimate that 60% uh, of the milk cows uh, have been uh, killed, are gone. Um, and then when it comes to meat uh, production, uh, that uh, meat cattle, as much as 70% of, of the stock uh, has been killed. And when it comes to small ruminants, so goats and sheep, that that percentage is about 60%. So these are large percentages, um, significant percentages of livestock, both for dairy and for meat, have gone. The new report shows that 1.1 million people in Gaza, half of the population, have completely exhausted their food supplies and coping capacities and are struggling with catastrophic hunger and starvation. This is the highest number of the people ever recorded as facing catastrophic hunger by the IPC system and doubled the number in IPC phase 5 just three months ago. The report also indicates a steep rise in child deaths due to acute malnutrition and diseases, leading to a classification of a famine projection. It is highly probable that the famine threshold for acute malnutrition will be surpassed, signaling the imminent onset of famine around May 2024. Khadija Tujala reporting for Africa News.